how to find the function outside of a function. In this video, I will show you step by step on how to solve this type of question and we'll start right now. Hello everyone, my name is Shirley and welcome to my channel. If this is your first time here and you would like to improve in your MX skills, start now by subscribing and clicking the bell so that you don't miss anything. Let's take a look at the first question. For question 1, given the functions hx is equal to 3x plus 2, khx equals to 9x squared minus 3x plus 10, find kx. So first of all, we write down the khx given. So khx equals 9x squared minus 3x plus 10. And then here, I'm going to put a square bracket because later, I'm going to substitute this 3x plus 2 into here. Okay, so now we substitute this into here. So hx is 3x plus 2. Okay, so I put here 3x plus 2. Okay, and we bring this down. So it'll be 9x squared minus 3x plus 10. And then, if there is a polynomial inside this bracket, we have to let 3x plus 2 equals to m and then we change we make it x as a subject on the left so it'll be x equals to m minus 2 over 3 okay and this one i take it as equation 1 then the next step is to substitute x equals to m minus 2 over 3 into this function okay so it will be k so 3x plus 2, we change it to m, okay? So it'll be m, okay, m over here. So the x, all the x we replace with m minus 2 over 3. Okay, we substitute this into here and also here. So it'll be 9 bracket m minus 2 over 3 square minus 3 m minus 2 over 3 and then plus 10. Okay, now we try to expand this. So become 9 m square minus 4m plus 4 over 9 and then minus you can cancel this off so m minus 2 and plus 10 okay now we can cancel this 9 and 9 so we'll get m square minus 4m plus 4 so I'm going to write this down so it's easy for us to see right plus 4 minus m plus 2 plus 10 and then we solve this so we'll get m squared so minus 4m then minus m we'll get negative 5m and then 4 plus 2 plus 10 we'll get 16 okay so for the final answer we have to change all the m to become x so kx equals to x squared minus 5x plus 16. So this is the final answer. For question 2, given the functions fx is equal to x minus 5, gfx is equal to 2x squared plus 3 minus 2x, find gx. So first of all, we write down the gfx given, which is g f x okay, equals to 2x squared plus 3 minus 2x and then we substitute fx which is x minus 5 into the square bracket so we get g x minus 5 equals 2x squared plus 3 minus 2x and then since there is a polynomial inside the bracket, we have to let x minus 5 equals to m. And then we make x as a subject. So x is equals to m plus 5. Okay, so I'm going to substitute this, I take it as equation 1, into this equation or function. Okay, so we'll get g 
So x minus 5 is m. So I'm going to substitute m into here and then m plus 5 into all the x here and here. Okay? So, so it's g m equals 2 m plus 5 square plus 3 minus 2 m plus 5. And then the next step is to expand this. So I'm going to write it down here. So it's 2. So we have to expand this. So we get m square plus 10m plus 25 and then plus 3 minus 2m minus 10 and then we have to expand this bracket so we get 2m square plus 20m plus 50 and then plus 3 minus 2m and minus 10 and then we solve this so we'll get 2m square plus 18m plus 43 okay so for the final answer we have to change all the m to x so it'll be g x equals 2x square plus 18x plus 43 and this is the final answer for question 3 given the functions mx is equal to negative 3x plus 1 and nmx equals to 1 plus 3x minus 9x square find nx so first of all we write down the function nmx given over here so nmx equals 1 plus 3x minus 9x square okay so I'm going to put a square bracket over here next I'm going to substitute mx which is negative 3x plus 1 into the square bracket so we get n negative 3x plus 1 and equals 1 plus 3x minus 9x square and then, since it's a polynomial inside the bracket, we let negative 3x plus 1 equals to y. Okay, so we make x as a subject. So 1 minus y equals to 3x. Okay, and then x is equals to 1 minus y over 3. Okay, I'm going to substitute this into this function, okay? So now, this bracket is actually equal to y. So I'm going to put ny over here, okay? Equals, then I'm going to substitute this into here and here. So be 1 plus 3, bracket 1 minus y over 3, and minus 9, 1 minus y over 3, whole thing square. Okay, next we're going to expand all the bracket. So it'll be equals 1 plus, okay, this 3 and 3 we can cancel off. So we get 1 minus y and then minus 9. Then we expand this bracket, we'll get 1 minus 2y plus y square over 9. Then we can cancel this 9 and this 9. Okay, so 1 plus 1 is 2 minus y then minus 1 plus 2y minus y square then we solve this we'll get 1 plus y minus y square okay and then they're asking to find an x which means that we have to change all the y to become x so the final answer is nx equals 1 plus x minus x square. So this is the final answer. Well, that's all for now. Do you understand what you have learned in this video today? Let me know in the comments below. If you find this video useful, hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe to my new videos every single week. 
thanks so much for watching and I hope you guys will keep on learning, keep on practicing and keep on watching my videos and I hope to see you in the next video. Bye!